No, we were pathetic. Absolutely pathetic. 36 years I think I've been involved in pro football. That's as, as long as 90 minutes of, that I've had to endure in that time. I feel sorry for the supporters. feel sorry for the people who've paid good money to come and watch that. Absolute utter crap. The team that was on the pitch before wouldn't have won the game. We had, no, no. Um, we... I've learned an awful lot about a lot of people today. And um, probably best leaving it at that. I keep telling these people, MLS is around the corner for this club. People are losing their chance of going with us by the week. This is an opportunity for some people. They don't, they don't get it. Some of them don't get it. They think you're just going to roll with us to the next level. And it's not going to happen. Because I ain't watching that. I feel sorry for the supporters who paid money to watch it. I can guarantee them. The next home game here, it will not only be like that. I guarantee you. I set the bar, not them. And they know what's expected of them. I have come in after games when we have lost games and praised the players because they've done everything that I've asked of them. So when it gets the other way, they, don't, they ain't getting away with it. Any, uh, they were, I thought Mould and James in particular probably had a good night mm -hmm. turned away some, some efforts unbelievably. Yeah. But, he was good on the night and the crossbar is maybe his friend. Yeah, they've, the we've hit the woodwork three or four times. We missed chances. Keepers made some great saves. That doesn't excuse the way that we've played between both boxes this evening. It's like we never. It's like you're watching a team as if they've never done any uh, coaching. We've never done any football work. The way you struggle to normally your game is, you know, let's get it down. We get it wide. The backs get, get it down. We move it quickly. It, getting people in holes. Some of the lack of, some nah. of the, some of it wasn't. It wasn't moving very quickly. Sometimes getting forward. No, nah, well, it was. That was a microcosm of the evening. No. Well, it is what it is, guys. I'm going to leave it at that, guys. Before I get the same thing. Now we do have a. Penalty kick awarded as Braun went down. Watson just tucks it inside. It's a goal for Orlando City. They lead it 1-0. A goal possibly to win it against Antigua. A golden goal to go with the golden band, correct? And Mulvin James down on his line. Had given it his all and didn't miss that save opportunity by much. It was close. Well, look, he tucked it left. It's not over. And tonight's tonight's performance is a disappointment, isn't it? Um, you know, we we expect better, we demand better of ourselves, and we'll we'll take the three points, but there's nothing good that'll come from it. So so now the mindset has to be, you don't forget this, you learn from it, you use it as motivation on Wednesday. Um, you know, a lot of people have to look in the mirrors at themselves, myself particularly, and and pinpoint what we're doing that's not working doesn't matter who you're playing. If you're playing the worst team in the league or the best team in the league, you have to make sure to hold yourself to a different standard. And we didn't do that tonight. And so um, there will be a lot, of, uh, a lot of looking at ourselves and trying to figure out what went wrong, what's working, how do we keep ourselves in the lineup, and how do we win games the way we are supposed to and not the way we did tonight. Ball through. Dom Dwyer is onside, shoots, and scores. Dom Dwyer, his 15th goal of the season. Flip to my loom, my darling.